Okay, as you can see, I'm here in a room. I'll stretch it out far. I'm basically, this is the first day of doing editing, basically post-production for Tales of the Hell, The Aftermath Chronicles, even though I'm still, still a month or two away from actually finishing the actual stop motion part and the audios. Um, I have enough material to where I can start cutting a trailer, a full trailer, and start getting the episodes put together bit by bit. So next step in this process in my week starting right now. Hey everybody, sorry I haven't shown much this week as far as stop motion goes, um, but I just finished today as my second day of stop motion this week, and as you can see here, these guys are posing for a group shot that I just took, and this scene was done, with, I showed a, you know, I'll show it on the screen that some of the Morrow characters are going to get a headshot, and, and he's bleeding out here obviously. So, and that's Henderson's kill. Henderson's headshot. <laughs> but so yeah, just got finished with that, and then have a little bit more stop motion to do tomorrow. Um, it's just a shot with Raylan fighting a Morrow squad on the top of here. And then we will be finished with this entire fight scene, which was awesome. I'm glad I'm going to be able to finish it this week, so we'll see you tomorrow. Hey, hello everybody, last day of shooting for this week and just working on the final shot for the scene and I spent like a half hour starting with an angle that wasn't the right angle because I had these guys positioned in the wrong direction. So I position, position them in the right direction and then get some background uh, set up here so the shot looks uh, believable and consistent. Um, and I'm going to start doing over again. I'm probably going to be like an hour or two uh, behind schedule for today. But at least I'm going to get this done today because this is the final shot. It'll take about an hour, hour and a half to do. And I'll walk you through some of it uh, in a moment. So uh, just give me a moment to start setting this up and then I'll show you what I'm exactly doing with this shot. Okay, I'm going to show you guys some of the process of what I'm doing. I'm actually going back to a, sh a wide shot of the scene that I'm doing that I shot uh, few weeks ago, about four weeks ago actually, it's been a while, but I'm going back and I'm going frame by frame to see the action. What I'm focusing on is this upper left hand corner where it shows a Raylan striking at these Amara warriors here and as you can see, if I go back, you can see where she's cutting off the leg of one of the warriors in the middle here. So I'm recreating that scene um, that shot at a different angle. I'll show you what I'm doing now. So what I'm doing is I'm referencing the movements, trying to get the movements as exact as possible for the other shot. So I already have these figures moved where they should be. Now I just need Raylan moved and this figure to turn into a figure with its leg chopped off. So I'll show you what I got here. So here we have Raylan and them. And then here is the figure with its leg chopped off. And now I'm going to have to replace this Morrow Warrior figure with that Morrow Warrior figure. And here, just one second, I just want to make sure that I get the point of reference right from this. Let's see, okay, so Raylan ends up being right there. And that figure is kind of standing like that on the space. Okay, so, so here. That's how it's going to work. Raylan's going to make actually a pretty big leap and see how high I keep on going back and forth. And this is for every single shot or the, every single picture I'm taking practically. I have to go back and reference. It takes a while, but it'll be worth it once it's all done. Okay, so Raylan makes a pretty big leap. 
kind of like move supersonic fast to get to to get to that creature. And then we're replacing that guy with this guy. And yeah, I think that'll work. It's not an exact, but it'll do the job. It, it, it's pretty much practically the same. So I will take that shot and see there it is in the screen. See the angle it's from. And I will take that shot. And one shot done. That took three minutes to do. <laughs> anyway, and then we'll just keep I'll just keep on going and well I'll check back in in a second and show you uh, how this shot ends. So just give me a little bit. Okay, anyway, forgot to show you, but I am finished. Sorry about not showing you, I actually just took a group shot. Okay, a little cast group shot of all the guys just gathered together because the scene is finished. Thank goodness. Wonderful fight scene. Contained all these characters. Um, but if I had to get this done, and then still have quite a bit of stop motion to do, but it's a lot simpler than what this is. So, okay, finished with this. Thank goodness. Now I can move on. Hey everybody, just finished uh, editing some more, cutting more of the trailer for Tale of Valhalla in this room, area, place thing. Um, there's some pictures scrolling across the screen. But anyway, uh, that's it for this week. And next week will probably be a lot more of what I'm already doing, but we'll see what happens, okay? See y'all next week.